A child lost his life when he drowned in a drainage system on Orla Avenue. It's always flooded. If, if, when it's raining, it's always flooded, very heavy. Deshaun Combis' body was found about three miles south of where he was last seen. He was helping his family move into their new home August 1st of last year when tragedy hit. Nearly a year later, his family is suing the city of Shreveport in a wrongful death lawsuit. We've looked into it, and from a, we think that there uh, should have been a, a grate on that culvert uh, from when it made the transition from a ditch to a subterranean hole. Neighbors say the ditch always seemed dangerous. But my grandkids is not going to come over here, no, because they, they, well, they already know. From a nationwide standpoint, uh, engineers are looking at culverts in this drains like this, especially in urban areas. Now this is the drainage ditch seven-year-old Deshaun fell into. Since he was swept away in 2017, the city has made changes to the system to make sure the incident doesn't happen to anyone else. They responded to this event by putting a grate on it. The city says facts surrounding the incident are still being studied. The family's lawyer says most of the kids like to play in ditches, so every potential problem should have been checked before Deshaun's tragic death. It's not the ditch so much as the transition from the ditch to the culprit that makes playing in a ditch a very dangerous activity. Now, a city spokesperson told us they don't come in on pending litigation, but did say their hearts are with Deshaun's family and they'll work to conclude this lawsuit with as little emotional impact to them as possible. Jackie. All right. A year later, still so sad. Thank you very much.